like a pair of new J's. Speaking of them, I got on the nine cool grays. Switching them up like eight day, them threes are like my face. Can't just cop a pair, I need a couple. I'm in the game, I got them J's, oh. Got them J's, though. Same ones that my homie MJ woke. I got them J's, though. I got them J's, though. Hit up the flight club, they know what I came for. The Pitt State women and men's basketball teams took part in a special Senior Day doubleheader this past Saturday, March 2nd, against Emporia State University. The men's team was on fire, hitting 11 three-pointers on their way towards an 82-55 victory against the Hornets. Freshman Caleb Porter was red hot from beyond the arc, hitting five three-pointers during the game to come out with 20 points total when it was all said and done. Freshman Jake Bollard and senior Courtney Ingram both had 10 points respectively, while seniors Javon McGee and Rico Pierovelas came out with 9 points. Senior Marky Nolan earned eight points while also leading the Gorillas in rebounds with eight. On the women's side, it was once again another close match with four ties and six lead changes in the first half. PSU went up by seven early in the second half but just couldn't keep the lead as Emporia State went on to win 63-55. to Senior Drew Roberts was celebrated before her game for earning her 1,000th point against Central Oklahoma on February 23rd. The second all-time career three-point shooter in school history was greeted by Coach Lane Lloyd for her accomplishments to a standing ovation at John Lance Arena. With it being the annual senior night, the seniors were brought out in between games with their families and were celebrated for their commitment to PSU Athletics. Seniors Javon McGee, Courtney Ingram, Marky e. Nolan, and Rico Pierovelis were all honored for the men's team, while seniors Lisa Elmer, Drew Roberts, and Lauren Brown were also honored on the women's side. Next up for both squads is a home divisional playoff round in John Lance Arena. The number seven seeded men's team will host Truman State on Monday at 7 p.m. and the seventh ranked women's team will play Missouri Western on Tuesday at 7 p.m. as well. If both teams come out the victor, they will move on to the MIAA tournament held in Kansas City at Municipal Auditorium that starts March 7th. For Pitt State Athletics, this is Tyler Smith reporting. Like a pair of new J's. Speaking of them, I got on the nine cool grace. Switching them up like eight day, them threes are like my face.